For the first time since 2018, thousands of athletes were able to compete in the New York City Triathlon once again. But as CBS 2's Christina Fan reports, this year's race took a unique turn. After a two-year hiatus, the New York City Triathlon kicked off with an unusual start. Instead of diving into the Hudson River, the race began with a one-mile run. There's things you can control and things you can, and you know it's still going to be a fun out there. Recent heavy rainfall caused bacteria levels in the Hudson to test nine times higher than what is deemed safe turning the triathlon into a duathlon. There was a little disappointment. I was looking for a big day today on a swim, a PR number, and it kind of, it was disheartening this morning to find out they canceled the swim. But families say considering the race was canceled back to back, first because of excessive heat and then COVID, they're elated just to be here. He's been trying to do it, I think the past, what, two years, but they had the pandemic and then weather related the year before. So we're here to cheer him on. He'll be 60 this year. These competitors say overcoming obstacles is what the race is all about. After the first leg, athletes continued on with a bicycle course along the West Side Highway. They finished with a foot race through Central Park. Today's a great day and great to see everybody out having a good time. In Central Park, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News.